Next, we want to install Python, and I'm going to install the standard Python download from python.org. So I'm going to go ahead and search for Python download. And the first link is download Python from python.org. And the current version right now is Python 3.9.6. And then after it's downloaded, go ahead and run the installer. So um, most of the defaults are OK, but it's important to go ahead and click this box for Add Python 3.9 to Path, um, because that's going to let you run Python from the command line without specifying the full path, and also for pip, which is the Python package installer. So um, I'm checking that box and then clicking Install Now. And then all the rest of it should just be default. OK, so that didn't take too long. Um, and then I go ahead and I check this uh, disable path length limit on Windows. Um, because if you add a lot of stuff to the path, it can actually hit that limit. Um, and then that should be everything for the Python install. So to make sure that we've actually done everything correctly, I'm going to search for CMD and then run a command prompt. And you should be able to say Python dash dash, whoops, Python dash dash version. And it should show you Python 3.9.6, which is the Python that we just installed. And you can also say pip dash v for the Python package installer. Um, and actually, maybe that was dash dash version 2. Um, no, OK. Um, so let's try pip dash dash version. Good. So it looks like everything is installed correctly, and we can move on to the next step.